Will here on the Florida Fisherman 2 with the crew. We're headed out on a 44-hour full moon deep sea fishing trip about 100 miles out from Hubbard's Marina in the Gulf of Mexico. Our main target tonight at least will be mangrove snappers. We'll fish for those for the majority of the night and other kinds of snapper as well. And sunup will target red grouper for most of the day. There has been some good wahoo action out there as well and when we move the boat We'll put some trollers out a few times and see if we can get one of those wahoos. We got one last week and hopefully get another one here today. But our main target tonight is mangrove snapper. And for those fish, we're gonna fish with our lighter tackle, smaller rigs, not a big hook and a hundred pound leader. We fish more 40 or 50 pound leader for the mangrove snapper and a four or five volt hook. The main bait we use for them is thread fin herring cut or live penfish, shrimp, or a variety of other dead cut baits. They're a pretty easy fish to catch, but they don't like big line and big hooks. So you have to fish with a little bit smaller tackle for them and a little bit more finicky than the grouper are. So that'll be our main target tonight. And then we'll go heavy line, trolling, and try to get some big fish in the daytime. We had a decent night of night fishing, a really good start to our night fishing. Big mangroves and picked at the fish throughout the rest of the night, put a real good catch together. And our nighttime fish are a long way away from the red grouper in the daytime. So we've taken a pretty substantial ride here, done some trolling, no wahoo yet. And now we're getting set up in our first red grouper area. It, not No fish yet, we're keeping after them, but we'll try many different areas today and hopefully one of them really pays off for us. folks we're wrapping up the trip here it's the second night of this 44 hour deep sea fishing trip we had a really nice weather trip nice smooth ride out good night of mangrove snapper fishing daytime we did a little bit of trolling in the morning on the way to our red grouper fishing grounds we, we missed one big fish we're not sure if it was a wahoo or not more than likely and then had a pretty good day on the red grouper uh, we fished heavy tackle for the red grouper and uh, bigger baits and a variety of cut dead fish for the red grouper and that worked out for us today got 20 or 30 keeper red grouper on board and a variety of other fish throughout the day but a little bit more fishing time here and we're wrapping it up headed back to john's pass we'll clean these fish up so everybody has them nice filleted bagged up ready to take home and enjoy
right, folks, we just made it back to the dock here at John's Pass, where the crew's busy unloading the fish right now. The customers are unloading all their gear. And by the time everybody gets their gear unloaded, the crew's gonna have a big pile of fish on the back of the boat. We'll let everyone get pictures of the catch, and then we'll give them their fish. Now, once they get their fish, they've got a few different options. They can take them, pack them in a cooler, we give them some ice, and they can head on their way. And a few people have a fish that's a contender for the jackpot. We do the, the biggest grouper and the biggest snapper jackpot. And some guys will weigh in a fish, see if they won the jackpot. Others will get their fish filleted. And we'll fillet them, skin them, debone your fish, and separate the species, put them in separate bags so you folks can take them home, easily identify them, and enjoy them. It's been a great trip, perfect weather this weekend. And just check us out on hubbardsmarina.com, Facebook, YouTube. Thanks for coming, guys.